time for an update on my strobe ant colony. Uh, these guys have only been featured once before on this channel, so I thought I'd just give you a little bit more of an insight into how they have been going and a little bit about this species. So, hope you enjoy this video. Let's get into it. So I've had this colony for a little while and I've just given them a basic outworld, uh, just shown here. So just a bit of sand in the bottom, a few rocks, a little bit of a feeder, I'm trying to keep it pretty basic. Don't need too much of a setup really for an outworld to keep your ants in, even this is overkill. So this colony of strobe ants has been housed in a high tech ants nest. Um, really nice nest. If you haven't seen my review on this, I'll um, put the card at the end of the video. But you can check them out. Also, a link down in the description if you want to check out their website and have a look at them. So, pretty cool little nest. This one's got that temperature and the humidity attached, which is really handy for keeping these guys um, at a temperature that I like them as well. So, let's get into having a look at the colony. So, this is the colony. So, we've got the queen there. Three workers in total and a few um, larvae there, a little bit of brood, coming along quite slowly in winter. Now I'm going to attempt again to say the Latin name. So Opis to Opsis, to Horax. So I think that's right. Now in the last video, I asked for name suggestions for this queen as well. And my daughter has picked the winner. And the winner is Queen Tiger Lily which is pretty cool. And I imagine, you know, that's a very fitting name really because of her orange and black. So my daughter loved that name. So here's a little bit closer up on this colony. So these ants are quite unique. I'm not sure if you can see it there. I'm going to get a little bit closer up, but the eyes of the workers are huge. Now, the reason for this, when these workers are out um, outside, out of the nest, they actually dart around basically like a jumping. And that's where they get their name strobe from. They're strobing around. Now they do this to avoid predators. So they need those big eyes so they can see as they go about doing this. Now the queen doesn't need the big eyes because she never leaves the nest. Also another feature is that these ants will not do that jumping strobing effect inside the nest because there's no predators to avoid. So I thought that was quite fascinating. What do you guys think? Do you like this uh, style of ant? A little bit different, isn't it? Now the brood is coming along nicely, but quite slow during winter. The species is quite slow to develop, but I'm really glad I've managed to get it here to the three workers that you can see here at the moment. The queen's doing well. I barely ever see them in the outworld foraging. Um, they must be, I guess, because um, they're doing well and progressing. And here we go, a little bit closer up. You can see the size of those eyes. Quite alien looking really, isn't it? This is pretty cool. Um, always such a variety in the species of ants that you can keep, which is really fascinating. So I hope you enjoy the little bit of a closer look at this uh, species, the strobe ants. You don't really see many videos on these guys and they're a really nice Australian species of ant. Beautiful colorings and Unique characteristics, that strobe effect, I'm gonna capture that and I'll share that with you guys in the next video when I do it on this colony as well because it's pretty cool seeing them jump around like that. Now, side point, I've been, I've reached the thousand subscribers so I'm working on a giveaway for you guys for that one as well. So stay tuned for that one. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification so you find out straight away when that competition comes out and give the video a thumbs up, guys. Um, it lets YouTube know that you like the video, you like the channel and the content as well, and it helps me, and I really love the support, guys. And that's what the giveaway is all about, just to give back to you guys for helping me and my journey along the way. It's been really enjoyable. So I hope you've enjoyed this. Again, the card's up the top if you want to check out the high-tech ants nest. And guys, remember, happy ant keeping. <laughs>